sake. <sighs> fuck. Oh, fuck you, you fucking fuck. Fuck. Morning. Sorry I'm late. I need something stronger. You need something stronger like what? I don't know man, I just... I need to get out of my head for a while. Weed just makes me depressed. You try brownies instead of joints. I'm not gay. That, that's not... That can be really offensive to some people. I need heroin. What the fuck? Come on, man, you're a fucking dealer. Yeah, at a fucking university. Who do you think I am? You and McGregor in that film. What film? Oh, um, y you know, that one with... Oh, I can't remember. Star Wars? Hey. Hey. Fuck, it's cold. Yeah, I can't even feel my legs. Uh, are you not enjoying the party? I saw two girls making out on the couch if you were interested. I'm in a wheelchair, it's uh, so much fun down here. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm kidding. So, why are you not in there making out with girls or something? Um, thought I'd come out for some fresh air, but then I saw that in your hand. Is that what I think it is? That's what you think it is. I think it's a joint. It's what you think it is. <sighs> I know this is horribly rude, but... Not at all. Uh. <coughs> 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 I'm Rebecca, by, by the way. Chris. Chris. So, uh, what brings you to the best house party in the world? <laughs> I, uh, keep asking myself that. You can't hate it any more than I do. Is this a challenge? <laughs> I don't much like challenges. I don't qualify for most. Well, you'd have a chance against me. I, uh... It lose. I live here. Can you imagine what it's going to be like when it's 5 a.m. and these idiots are still up? <laughs> well, at least you don't have to take the walk of shame. I live on campus and there are no buses anymore. Well, there's an empty room upstairs. You could give that a try. You probably have to lock the door so no one, no one rapes you in your sleep. <laughs> you uh, sound like you have a routine. I'd do it without hesitation. <laughs> Assuming I could walk up the stairs. There's a, there's no nice way of, of saying this, but um, I work with people with disabilities. Uh, we we have a community on campus with regular meetings and activities. Thanks, I'll, uh, I'll keep that in mind. Uh, 
I, I didn't mean to attack you, I just... <laughs> nah, it's, it's cool, really. E even if you don't want to, I uh, could al always give you my number, just to make sure. do it myself. That is only fair after all. My love Cleopatra is dead and I can never again taste the fluids of her love on my tongue. What do you think everyone? Point taken my dear audience, point taken. I speak way too much. But basically he doesn't die. He survives cries about it for about two minutes and basically he gets taken over to see Cleopatra who still is not dead by the way um, and then basically he dies knowing that Cleopatra faked her death. It's what was that bit about the fluids? Oh, uh, but basically, no, I feel like before committing suicide, I should commemorate eating Cleopatra's pussy. <laughs> really? Well, yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it's Cleo. She's the best pussy in the world. She's numero uno, my friend. You could travel the world three times over trying every single pussy there, and none of them, none of them would be on the same level as her. Honestly, man, even through that whole shit storm with Octavius and all that, basically what happened was Anthony forgets what's important to him, which is obviously clear. So, you know, he fucked up, he lost her, he killed himself. She was worth it. Are you... Are you trying to say that love is worth dying for? Definitely. Yeah, man, you just... You've got to find your Cleopatra. And obviously, once you do, the real sort of baseline of this story is you never take your tongue out of her. <laughs> Oh, uh, by the way, uh, Jess left. She's gone. They're recasting Cleopatra. Yeah, so I don't really know what's going on there. Oh, I also wanted to show you the gun. But I don't know where it is. That's annoying. Sorry, man. Is this a date? Uh, no, it's, um, no, it, it's business. I'm listening. <laughs> Look, I was thinking about some of the stuff you said about the, uh, disabled society. <laughs> it's a community, yeah. Well, there's no fucking way I'm joining. <laughs> so, this is a date then? <laughs> It's just that I can't see myself sitting in the same room as a load of other people who have the same or worse situation that I'm in and crying about my problems as if it's going to make it better. I just don't think I could do it. What I think I do need is help or something, you know, just with everyday things. I don't fucking know. I've been doing fine. When did you... Last spring. My parents have been annoyingly supportive. <laughs> so has everyone, actually. No, you know what? Fuck this, I've changed my mind. It doesn't even matter, you know. It's not like I have to shit in diapers or anything. Fuck. Let's do this once again. Hi, I'm Rebecca, and I help people in need for free. For free? Really? Yeah. Shit, why? It's... I don't know. I, I just like to do it. Any experience? Yeah, um, I've done first aid training. You know, mouth to nose, mouth to mouth. Yeah. And I've been a member of the Help Each Other Society since the beginning of uni year. Um, I've met a lot of amazing people. I think it could really help me gain some experience, I'd say. That's really cool. So, uh, you. Who are you exactly? I'm not good at roleplaying. <laughs> I'm sure that isn't true. I'm Chris. And I'm a 
person in need. So, this is my room. That's the floor that I spend countless hours chilling out on after I fall off my bed. But, you know, I do it on purpose, so... Um, these are some drawers. Yeah. <laughs> Psychology. Cool. Not really. What do you study? Nursing? Uh, drama. Oh! So, <laughs> I take it you know Tommy? Hilton. Uh, yeah, he's in my improv seminar. Oh. Okay. You might be the next on his list then. He wants to sleep with all five of you. <laughs> he does? Yeah. Well, good luck to him. <laughs> yeah, um, but you can sit, sit down and, um, you know, we can talk about it. I, I don't know. I, I swear I don't usually do this. Let me interpret the uh, no need for diapers part. Oh no, it's <laughs> no, um, <laughs> no, it's no, no, pl no please don't. It, no, it, it doesn't fucking work. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Yeah. Um, I thought we could uh, chat or, or something. Yeah, sure. It's a short story. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just finishing it now, actually. Oh, okay. Um, quite a two lesbians, right? Yeah, kind of lesbian, I guess. How did it end again? Okay, so um, there's these two best friends, and well, one of them wants more. Oh. And yeah, it, it, it doesn't work out. Cool, though. Lesbians are cool. <laughs> yeah.
Jess. Open the door. Open the door, please. Come on. Jess. Let's go outside and have a conversation. Let's talk about this, alright? <laughs> Can't just go outside, man. I'm, I'm at work. Mate, mate, I don't care. Let's go outside and talk. I can't. I can't just come outside, man. You see, I'm working. Mate, so there's people here, okay? Just calm down. I don't want to cause a scene. Just calm down. If there's something you want to talk about, talk about it. Mate, here. mate. I'm not going mate. outside. I'm Let's just go outside you. and talk. No, I can't Let's go, go outside. outside. Listen! Let's go outside and talk! Girlfriend, pick a girl, man, or fuck anyone. Episode? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, he's nothing special, like, in bed either, but he asked me out today, so I guess we'll see what happens. You sure? Oh yeah. I mean, he was really nice to me today. And he works in student television, you know, with the radio shows and stuff. Those guys are weird. Mm, I guess. But, you know, I can introduce you to you sometime. See what you think of him. <laughs> you better. If he's not good enough, I'll kick him out. <laughs> Thanks. You are my guardian angel. Yeah. <laughs> so, I, I nearly got arrested today. You what? Yeah, I tried to rob a shop with a toy gun. Um... <laughs> what, seriously? Uh, I apologised straight away. But... Campus watch got well, me. Well, why would? Why did you? I mean, what? Well, we were at work, and oh, work. I I say I get it. Yeah. You impress him? I don't know. Hey, same applies. He hurts you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he acts like he's all about girls. At the same time, he's, he's also really... Really? Let's just change the subject. Okay. So what about that other guy? Hmm? Yeah, I'm meeting him tomorrow. When? Oh shit, man, they have strawberry smoothies here. Am I 
and get one of those. Not that they're genetically modified strawberries. That shit's everywhere right now. You know they force it to grow like that. It's some Frankenstein shit. They just spray these chemicals on the fruit. It's like animals born in captivity. Very unhealthy. <laughs> you fucking idiot, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, why don't we rob a bank next time? Really? Okay, yeah. mate. Yeah. Sorry, man. Can I help? Right, can I have a clean book? Yes, of course, Ken. Anything to drink, that, mate? No, no, it's just a just... But yeah, no worries. It's five pounds, big print. Thank you very much. Sat down there, right? Yeah, yeah. Awesome, man. We'll have that over to your table in a minute. Cheers, Thanks, man. Fuck. What? I can't remember if I took my tablet this morning. Tablet for what? Uh, manic depression. Ooh. I could do with a couple of those. Yeah. I mean, it's been pretty hard since coming here, but I think I'm getting better, so that's good, right? Yeah. Dude, have you heard the song? I think it's in that show Boy! Hey, man. Hey. Hey, man. Oh, I, I left the gun upstairs. Okay. Um, just a, a minute. Are you in a hurry? Uh, why? I made some brownies. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm fine, mate. Thank you. I'm, I'm cool. No, I mean, uh, brownie brownies. I... I brownie brownies. I really fucked that dude up, didn't I? Yeah. I, f I actually feel really bad, man. Tommy Hilton feels bad. <laughs> you must be high. <laughs> I am high. Hey, <laughs> 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 to... Oh, shit. Um, sorry. Um... I'm just going out, Mark. Is that okay? Yeah. Yeah. Kids have fun. Should I put some music on? Something. I, I don't care. Fuck it then. <laughs> Fuck it. Fuck this, man. Fuck all of this. This is bullshit. This, this isn't me, man. You know, this whole fucking thing is just some bullshit character. Fucking Tommy Hilton. Bullshit. This fucking pie fucking teen drama. Bullshit. Man. I, I had. Uh, I had a brother, a twin brother, George. Um, man, we were identical. Yeah, we were different, but in so many ways we were exactly the same. And, you know, we used to just mess around all the time, swapping our clothes, changing our names. Mum and Dad didn't have a fucking clue. No one did. It was, it was really cool. 
one day we we were playing outside the house, just outside the house, and we were five, and he just tripped and fell, and he died. I'm sure you, you probably just think I'm joking, right? It's just it's so fucked up man. No one no one knows this stuff and I just can't I can't forget about it. I just can't I can't remember whether or not you know I was him or if he was me, if we'd have swapped our clothes and our names and that shit. I, you know, maybe in some weird m mixed up fucking way man, maybe I'm, I'm the one who died, you know, maybe, maybe it was me.